really happy with the fact that you know India has got its first Starbucks and we can all enjoy a lovely cup of coffee but uh, why has it taken you so long? Everyone has asked me why it takes so long. I like to know the answer myself but the <laughs> truth is as you know this is a very complex market to enter. Right. At one point we thought we could come here alone mm -hmm. and I think we, we overestimated the complexity but once we met the people from Tata we realized overnight that the assets were so complementary between Tata and Starbucks that together we could co-author a very unique strategy, bring Starbucks to India and over time build a very substantial significant business together. Right. But you know, you have actually uh, traveled far and wide, entered several markets and done very well for yourself yes. alone. So given that, uh, why did you decide to come into India with a partner A in the first place and B, given the fact that we don't have any restrictions in uh, FDI and single brand retail because you can go up to 100%, why don't you just do it on your own? Well, India is like no other market in the world. You know that. <laughs> uh, and I think Tata's position in India is very unique, a company that has such unique capabilities in terms of infrastructure, but mostly I think their values were so consistent with ours, building a company with a conscience, treating people well, taking care of the communities. And we thought this was a, an opportunity to do something together that uh, we could just couldn't do ourselves. This really comes from a deeper philosophy I believe Starbucks is practicing globally where you know you believe growth going forward is not going to be simply by expanding your outlets but really by you know looking at a diversification in your portfolio and your product offering sure. which is why you're looking at possibly even alcoholic drinks uh, which is, you, you've done your homework I have to right <laughs> so um, a, if you can talk to me about that strategy and B if is that what we're gonna see in India as well well, let's frame the, the Starbucks business today. We have 18,000 stores in 60 countries. India will be 61. Uh, we're serving about 70 million customers a week and we employ over 200,000 people. The brand equity of Starbucks around the world is one of the most recognized and respected of any consumer brand. Sure. Over the last few years, we have developed multiple channels of distribution, primarily in grocery stores, uh, mostly in North America, although we are now looking at other places. We don't generally uh, move to those channels of distribution until we have established the brand within our retail stores. Sure. We do think there are multiple channel opportunities within India, but only after we establish the brand. Sure. But the market here is large and robust. We will, we will have a uh, business here in India that will go beyond our retail stores over time. To watch more, subscribe to youtube.com slash etnowlight.